Wait lang ulan, wait lang, magpifilm muna, catch. Pang last na talaga, last na. Simulan na natin to. Hi baby girls, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be my January 2018 favorites. Oh my gosh, 2018 na baby girls. By the way, pasensyahan nyo noon, when I sat down to film, it started to rain. Malas. <laughs> Bakit ako parang yellow? Parang yellow yung kulay ko. Nakakaloka. Pero, yun nga. Today, I will be sharing with you my favorite products for the month of January. So, if you're interested, just keep on watching. Alright, baby girls. Siguro, let's start with the non-makeup product. Um, ito, actually, na-mention ko na to before. Feel ko talaga pangit yung lighting. Pasensya nyo na, ha? I'm working with a new background kasi. Kasi nag-rearrange kami dito sa bahay. Pero, please tell me your thoughts in the comment section below. Anyway, ito na nga, it's a non-makeup product. And I've mentioned this before, pero matagal ko na siya hindi nagagamit. Ilang months na rin. And then, ngayon ko lang siya ginamit ulit. It's the Bench Organics 92% Aloe Face and Body Mist. And it looks like this. And mabibili niyo to sa bench for like 229 pesos yata. Favorite na favorite ko to guys. Minsan nga sa morning, like after washing my face, ito na lang yung nilalagay ko. And then, syempre, sunblock kapag lalabas ako. I really, really like this. It's very refreshing and <laughs> you can even apply this like over makeup and gagawin mo siyang setting spray ayan tapos ipadry mo lang siya it works para mag set yung makeup mo sa yung face para the powder products will not look as powdery on your face and they will melt on your face okay na okay to it's very cooling on the face and napaka bango niya as in it smells like cucumbers. Yung, yun yung naalala ko sa kanya. And then, kahit na spray lang siya, yung tubig lang siya, I really feel na na-moisturize na yung aking skin. So yeah, I really, really like this. And the next favorite na hindi makeup item is this lash curler right here. This is from Shiseido. Bigay ito ni Saik sa akin. Thank you, Saik. Ginagamit ko na siya all the time. And as you can see, medyo marumi na siya. So, I'm sorry. It really does the work. Kinakurl niya talaga yung lashes mo. And... Parang hindi mo na siya kailangan ulit-ulitin ng ganyan yung lashes mo sa pagkukurl kasi kahit konting ganyan lang, nakakurl na talaga yung lashes mo. And I think this one is really suited for Asian eyes, yung Shiseido na lash curler. I think dupe din yan no, Shumura lash curler, diba? So, yeah, I really, really like it. I think she got this no pumunta sila sa Japan. So, thank you so much, Seik. I've really been liking it. Tapos, hindi siya masakit kapag ginaganyan mo siya. Pero, kung wala kang budget na bumili ng Shiseido or Shumura Lash Curler, you can also purchase yung sa Nichido. Maganda din yun. Tapos, meron sila yung specifically na ginawa daw for Asian eyes. That's what I have. It's only 188 pesos yata. And, yeah. Dalawa kasi yung klase ng lash curler nila. Yung parang nasa plastic na lalagyan and yung nasa parang box na lalagyan. So, yun yung kunin nyo. Yung nasa box. Yung mas mahal. Yun yung kunin nyo. Kasi mas maganda yun para sa akin. Alright. Next up, medyo binibilisan ko yung pagsasalita ko kasi umuulan na babigyas. Baka lumakas siya. Tapos hindi niyo na ako marinig. Heto, I have another non-makeup product. And a lot of you actually ask me, especially sa mga foundation reviews ko, kung ano yung paborito ko na blotting sheets. And there this one. Ito yung Gatsby Oil Clear Sheet. Ayan, there's a better look. And when you open it up, it actually looks like yung pons na... Ay, pons. Pans ba yan? No, clean and clear blotting sheet na ganyan. Blue na yung kulay niya ngayon, baby girls. Pero noon, black pa to. Meron pa nga ako nung black nito, konti na lang. Pero, ayan, I repurchased. Kasi, gusto ko yung isa sa bag. Tapos, yung isa pang review. Kaya, ayan. Blue na siya. Mas gusto ko yung black. Wala lang. Parang mas unique siya. <laughs> pero, the reason why I really like this, kahit na medyo mahal siya, I think it's 100 less than 120 for 70 sheets. Gustong-gusto ko talaga to kasi natatanggal niya talaga yung oil on my face. And kahit isang sheet lang, tapos oiling-oily na ako, natatanggal niya pa rin, caring-caring pa rin. Of course, it would be better kung dalawang sheet, pero kung nagtitipid ka, isang sheet lang sa pagbablot, okay na okay lang. Kaya niya. Yun kasi ibang blotting sheets, kapag tinanggal mo yung oil mo ganyan, nagtatransfer yung oil from the blotting sheet to your fingers nakakaloka. Pero yun, na-absorb niya talaga yung oil on your face. And you look instantly refreshed after blotting. I love it. Alright, next up, dako naman tayo sa mga pangkilay na naging favorite ko for this month. And I have two. Pero first, i-share ko muna sa inyo yung mas matagal ko nang ginagamit. This is by the brand Colorette. Nakuha ko to sa Colorette Silang on Instagram or meron din sa Facebook. 
Ayan, gusto ko siya kasi it has a spoolie already. Ayan, oh, may spoolie na siya on one end. Tapos, retractable din siya as you can see. Oh, I've been using this product for such a long time pero ang dami-dami pa rin niya. Nakakaloka, baby girls. Sulit na sulit. This is called the Colorette Brow Fashional Automatic Waterproof Eyebrow Pencil yata. Tapos, totoo nga, waterproof talaga siya. Natry ko nang mag-swimming and ito yung gamit ko. And andun pa rin talaga yung kilay ko. Yun nga lang, pag ginagamit mo to, waterproof siya. Pero hindi siya smudge proof. So kapag nabasa siya and then ginanyan mo siya, matatanggal siya. Hindi naman niya sinabing smudge proof. Waterproof lang naman sinabi niya. So totoo nga, I have mine in the shade Mocha. And isa swatch ko yan for you. Swatch ko siya for you, baby. Oh no! Naputo! Ay, ang sayang. Ang laki nung naputol. Oh. Ah, kunti na lang. Tapos pangit na yung shape nyo. It's okay. Matipid naman siyang gamitin. Ayan. That is the shade Mocha for you. Naputol yung pangkilay ka. <sighs> Pero anyway. Gustong gusto ko siya kasi hindi siya masyadong waxy. And madali lang siyang sumulat sa iyong kilay. Pero hindi ganun kadali like other super creamy brow pencils. Hindi ko yung gusto yung mga super creamy brow pencils kasi madali ako nagkakamali. Pag ginanyan mo siya, madali siyang sumulat, pero hindi yung uh, uh, parang slidey siya na brow pencil, baby girls. Hindi ganun. Gustong gusto ko siya. I love it. Maganda din yung kulay niya. Hindi siya reddish tignan sa aking kilay. And the spoolie is also really, really nice as well. Good job, Colorette. This is such a nice brow pencil. And of course, since medyo dark itong brow pencil na to, ginagamitan ko siya ng brow mascara after. Pero matagal ko nang nami-mention yung brow mascara na favorite ko, so hindi ko na siya mention By the way, gumawa ako ng How I Do My Kilay. I will put the link in the description box below. Or you can check out my channel, Brows Brows Nyo in case makalimutan ko ilagay yung link sa description box below. <laughs> Alright, and then another brow product that I've been trying this month is this one from NYX. It's their eyebrow gel na waterproof, long-lasting, and smudge-proof. Oh, there is a better look on the product. This one is in the shade Blonde. This is what I have on my brows right now. Um, maganda siya. I really, really like it kasi talagang it stays on the brows for such a long time, baby girls. As in, hindi siya matatanggal hanggat hindi mo siya tinatanggal. Kahit na oily yung face ko, it stays on my brows. Hindi nawawala yung arch ng kilay ko. Kasi yun yung problema ko. Kapag nag-oil up na ako, madalas yung mga pangkilay natatanggal dito sa arch ko. Natatanggal yung arch ko. Parang nagiging straight na lang siyang ganyan. Especially when I blot this part, natatanggal. So, masali yung kilay ko. Tapos, it also already acts like yung brow mascara kasi sumusunod yung buhok sa kilay ko sa kanya kapag dinrowing ko siya pag ganyan sumusunod yung kilay ko it lays flat on my face kaya gusto gusto ko siya kung gusto mo ng defined look yung parang on fleek talaga na kilay this is for you yun nga lang kailangan siya ng more time and siguro kailangan ko pa magpractice sa kanya Oh, uh, yan yung nagawa kong kilay using this one. Pero pinatungan ko siya ng something else kasi I messed it up when I was doing my foundation. So, yun. Pero most of this is the NYX eyebrow gel. Okay, so moving down. Meron ako naging favorite na eyeliner this month. And I was doing my, ano ba yun, yung bir birhen makeup tutorial. And... Yung first na ginamit kong eyeliner noon is the San San eyeliner pen. And then while I was doing my wing, um, it gave me a hard time kasi nag-dry out na yung San San eyeliner pen ko. So, ayun, tinapon ko na siya. Then, naghanap ako dito sa vanity ko ng ano pang murang eyeliner na meron ako. And ito yung nakita ko. Princess Liquid Eyeliner. I got this from Daiso. Ayan, that's how it looks like. 88 pesos lang to, baby girls. Pero, it's the blackest, blackest liquid liner ever. And it's also matte. Tapos, for beginners, I think itong applicator na to is very nice kasi parang dip liner siya. Parang stick siya. Na, parang toothpick siya ba? Oh, matigas siya, baby girls. Tapos, I'll show you a swatch, ha? Of this liquid liner. Look at that. Oh, black na black. Itim na itim talaga, baby girls. Tapos, madali lang din siyang mag-dry, which is what I like from liquid liners. Gusto ko yung madaling mag-dry kasi ayoko yung 
Gumawa ganyan ako for 5 minutes waiting for my liquid liner to dry. Alright, moving on, I also tried a new mascara this month and I did really like it. It's the CoverGirl, the Super Sizer mascara and it looks like this. This one is available locally. I don't know how much it costs, baka less than 400 pesos, ganun, mga 350 to 400 pesos siguro yung presyo nito. And ito yung nilagay ko sa lashes ko. Of course, I have fake lashes on, pero sa lower lashes, yan yung nilagay ko. Maganda siya kahit siya lang yung walang false lashes kasi it really volumizes and lengthens my lashes. Tapos, yung wand niya is actually pretty interesting. Oh, medyo unique tignan yung wand niya as you can see, baby girls. Pero it's very easy to apply this on the lower lashes. And nakukuha mo talaga yung inner corners mo kasi hindi ganun kataba yung wand niya. So yeah. I really like this. This was a really good buy for me. So, bonggang bongga yon. If you're looking for an affordable mascara na maganda, you could go ahead and try that. Like, if you want to try something new. Next up, let's talk about some face products. Uh, meron ako naging favorite na blush for the month. And actually, matagal ko na tong ginagamit. I think I featured this sa aking yearly favorites, pero hindi itong shade na to. Pero recently, I've been diving into this shade a lot. As you can see, medyo. Uh, marami na siyang parang dot dot <laughs> from the brush. Um, this is the EB Advanced Cheek Color in the shade Rose. Ang ganda-ganda nito, you guys. It's the blush that I have on my cheeks right now. Pero konti lang yung nilagay ko sa cheeks ko kasi my eyes are already pretty dramatic. So, yan. Nilagyan ko lang ng konti para at least meron konting life yung ating face. It's really very nice. These blushes from EB, yung mga ganito, are very, very creamy and buttery and blendable. They do feel high-end and I suggest na bumuli kayo ng some shades for yourself and try it out for yourself. Sometimes I even use this as eyeshadow kasi ang ganda-ganda talaga ng formula niya, Bebe Gels. It's very easy to work with, very pigmented, color payoff is bonga and very easy to blend. Another favorite blush for this month is this one from Daiso again. Ganito yung itsura niya and I think this one is in the shade... Rose? Yeah, Rose. So, I mainly use this one. Hindi ko madalas ginagamit ito kasi masyado siyang maputi na highlight, baby girls. Ayan, ganyan yung isura niya. Diba, napaka-puti. Pero this blush though, oh, ang ganda-ganda. I don't know if you will be able to see it, pero I'll put more. Ayan siya, baby girls. Diba, isn't that such a nice blush? It suits my skin tone so well and I think it will suit most Filipina skin tones kasi medyo corally, peachy blush siya. Ang ganda-ganda as in. And considering that it's from Daiso, for 88 pesos and dalawang produkto na to, I think it's very, very okay. Yung formula niya is a little dry, pero it is blendable. And maganda yung pigmentation niya. Okay. Next up is my favorite highlight of the month. Pero hindi ito yung gamit ko ngayon, baby girls. Ooh, look at my highlight now. Oh. Anyway, Yung mostly ginagamit ko for the month is the BYS Sculpt and Glow Highlight Bronze and Blush Palette. Since it's done, I bought this nung sale nila kasi medyo mahal to ngayon, um 1100 yata. Pero you already get 5 products inside as you can see. Yung madalas kong ginagamit dito are the highlighters because they are so freaking bonga, the big girls. Like look, it's a swatch ko sila ha. Oh, tignan niyo naman yan. That is something that you can get just right in Watson's or SM department store. And when you apply it on your face, it looks like something you got from Sephora. There are these two shades right here. I hope you can see how like blinding these are. Super ganda nitong dalawang to baby girls. It also doesn't accentuate my pores. Tapos super tagal niyang naglalast sa skin ko. Ang ganda. Kahit na nagblot na ako, anjan pa rin yung highlight ko. They be popping. Ang bonga. <laughs> also, the formula of this is not that creamy, buttery, or super easy to blend. Pero, nagustuhan ko pa rin siya. I think, if you purchase it for the regular price, I think sulit naman siya. Kasi 5 products na siya inside. Diba? Ay, malapit na ako malobat, baby girls. Okay, let's talk about these products faster. I have 3. I have two lip products to share with you guys today. And yung first is a liquid lipstick. Hindi ako masyado nagwe-wear ng liquid lipsticks as some of you may know. Kasi mas tayo ko talaga yung bullet lipsticks. Pero for this month, I've been wearing these Wet n Wild Liquid Catsuit Lipsticks. 
I actually have all 13 shades of these lipsticks. And ito yung pinaka favorite ko in the shade Rebel Rose. Binigyan ako ni Nice or All Stuff Nice dito sa YouTube. Ilalagay ko yung link niya sa description box below. Ayun yung shade niyo. Oh, ang pangit kong mag-swatch. <laughs> Isn't it so beautiful? Tapos, it flatters my skin tone so well. Ang ganda-ganda ng lipstick na to. Tapos, it is pretty long-lasting for a liquid lipstick. And, hindi siya masyadong drying considering it's a liquid lipstick. I can get away with wearing this. Mas gusto ko to compare dun sa mga Colourpop or yung Vice Cosmetics. Mas bongga to para sa akin. And finally, last product for this favorites video. This is also such a bonga lipstick for such an affordable price. Ayan, there we go, baby girls. This one is the Makeup World na lipstick. I don't know anong tawag sa kanya talaga. Basta, this one is in the shade Prague. And I got this for only 158 pesos yata. Basta, less than 160. And look at that shade, though. I will swatch it for you, baby girls. Super ganda ng lipstick na ito. Ayan, that second one right there. Bakit ba hindi ako marunong mag-swatch? Pero, I wore this in one of my videos and super ganda niya. It's really flattering on my skin tone. Tapos, it's very, very long-lasting, baby girls. As in, kahit na kumain ako, andun pa rin siya. And, considering na murang-mura lang siya and the color payoff is bonga. I love it. Ang ganda. I really like that it's very long-lasting and hindi siya drying sa lips kahit na matte siya. And I like that it's very, very affordable. Diba? 158 pesos lang. San ka pa, baby girls? Alright, so actually, yun lang naman lahat ng aking mga favorite products for the month of January. Sana nag-enjoy kayo sa video na to, baby girls! And, and kung nag-enjoy kayo or if you found this helpful, kindly give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell para ma-update ka every time I upload a new video, which is every single day. And to help this plump caterpillar to become a butterfly. That's it. Thank you so much for watching, baby girls. I hope to see you in the next vlog tomorrow. Bye! Pasensya na mamadali talaga ako kasi umuulan na. Malakas na siya. Baka lalakas pa. And maglalobat na ang battery ko. Pero thank you for watching. Bye! Wow, chika, bwow, bwow. Yun kasi ubang... Uban. Yung si Desh.